Welcome back to Brawler's Corner, the place where you ask the questions and I give the answers. You guys have been giving me some great questions. Let's see what questions we have this week. Here we go. The first question is from Brandon from Detroit, Michigan. Asks, what was it like being managed by Bobby the Brain Heenan? Well, Brandon, that was the biggest break I've ever gotten in my career. Bobby was one of the greatest people I've ever known. Knowing Bobby Heenan validated my career. Just to walk out to the ring with him was exciting. He had so much charisma, one of the funniest men that I've ever known, and he's dearly missed. He is gone, but will never be forgotten. And this is a picture that's very close to my heart. Question number two comes from Cindy from Miami, Florida. My favorite character in wrestling was Abe Knuckleball Schwartz. What was that like? Well, Cindy, Abe Knuckleball Schwartz was a very unique character. I came up with it myself. I got it from a movie, actually. I seen an image in a movie, I copied it, I had it drawn out and created it. I presented it and it was accepted. I can remember it like it was yesterday. Question number three comes from Bruno from Chicago, Illinois. What was it like traveling on the road with WWE? Well, Bruno, I can honestly say it was very hectic. It was two to four planes a week for 32 years. I was on a plane constantly, taking off, sitting on that plane for hours and hours and hours. It got a little monotonous on the airplane, but I still loved what I did. Question number four. Sasha from Portland, Oregon asks, what was the funniest prank you witnessed on the road? Well, Sasha, that was a loaded question because there was many pranks on the road. But one that comes to mind right now is we're, in a, we're on the road in a dressing room and Jake the Snake Roberts was in WWE at the time and he had a 10 foot python. So the company always kept like 50, 60, maybe 70 rats in like a 50 gallon fish tank in a certain room. I walked into that room and I seen a wrestler with a very sinister smile on his face. I looked at him and I kind of seen what he was about to do, but I didn't like it. He turned the fish tank over and let the rats run wild through, throughout the building. It was terrible. The building got infested with rats and it wasn't a happy ending. Question number five comes from Peter from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Peter asks, what was your greatest experience with a WWE fan? Well, Peter, I had so many great experiences with WWE fans that I would have to say my greatest experience was with Make-A-Wish fans. Because Make-A-Wish fans were special to me. Because it makes you realize that these kids are still happy even though they're in Make-A-Wish. It just touched my heart every time. Well, that's another edition of Brawler's Corner. Keep those questions coming and press that subscribe button because if you press that subscribe button, you will know before anybody, and I mean anybody, that a new video comes out. You'll be the first one to know. It'll come, it'll come a notification. You'll get all the information and go right to that video because you don't want to miss one because Brawler's Corner is your corner. Keep the questions coming. Go to brawlerscorner at gmail.com or tweet me at Brawler Real. And send me the questions and I will give you the answers.